Breaking news, my wonderful people. President Muhammadu Buhari finally speaks on supporting Peter Obi. Now, Peter Obi is not a man who came sharing money and like, you know, the traditional way that Nigerian politics has been engulfed in. The more money you had to spare or spend, the more you could possibly, you know, gain the favor of the people. Once upon a time, Nigerians have become so tired of the same status quo and they saw a man with a difference. And so the support has been enormous. Peter Obi's fame and, you know, acceptance has grown from the north to the south, so much so that, you know, today, Nigerians, you know, everywhere you go, in almost every discussion, even in churches, mosques, they may not want to, you know, they may not want to say anything about it. You know, they may want to quench the discussion. But they've heard of the name of Peter Obi. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Like us, share, subscribe. Let's get all the details. Breaking news. President Muhammad Buhari speaks on supporting Peter Obi. President Muhammad Buhari has, has clarified that he will only support candidate filed by the All Progressive Congress, APC. This was contained in a statement sent to Politics Nigeria on Wednesday evening, signed by Garuba Shew. The statement reads, The President wishes to put it on record that at the same time reassured faithful party members that President Muhammad Buhari remains a disciplined soldier. We will not, we will not see, we will not do anything of the All Progressive Congress, APC, and will in all the forthcoming elections support only those candidates filed by the party and no other. This is a warning to the camp party members to some others who are still in court against official candidates of the APC that they are on their own and nobody outside the party tent should link what they are doing to President Muhammad Buhari. The president wishes to quote as saying that he is the occupant of the highest office of the president by the grace of God who used the instruments, instrumentation of APC to bring him to power with a historic victory in 2015 and 2019. He was returned with a bigger majority for the first time. A non-PDP government came to power with a huge majority after 16 years from the Fourth Republic. His consistent refresher is that I will not betray or undermine my party by supporting candidates other than those of the APC. This statement is not against any particular candidate. However, our stand is clear that only those candidates filed by the All Progressive Congress, APC, will enjoy the support of the president and they are the ones he will campaign for. However, we welcome support for our candidates at all level by other party members. The president said he will continue to support the party at all levels to enforce discipline and coordinate coordination. So also direct officers and around the presidential villa and all who engage in loose talk to desist from making controversial statements that eventually ends up hurting the party and the government, thereby providing a weapon for the opposition to use against the administration, the party and its candidates in the coming election. We must be careful. So there you have it. President Muhammad Buhari has made a solemn vow and play to all in his party that he will not support any other party member other than his party members yes so this is exactly what is happening it's okay i mean when you uh, 
myself and yourself, um, our children cannot be involved in a sport, then I'll leave my son and start supporting your son. How do we do that? Does it make sense? So who's going to support my son? Who's going to share him up? So it's like that. I can understand if he says he will not support anybody. Okay, there's no there's no force with that. He's not going to support anybody. That's absolutely fine. Okay, that's absolutely fine. Well, okay, so this is what is happening right now. Whether you like it or not, Peter B is a force. And um, those who are trying to undermine, okay, those who are trying to undermine him and make it look like he has no voice, blah, blah, blah. They are really making a huge mistake. I must assure you for free. I must assure you for free because it's not going to work. It's not just going to work. Okay, so it is time we all get on board and ensure that, you know, the right candidates become our leader. If we continue in the way we are, we're going to get things really, we're going to get things really not, not in a very good position. And so the time to move ahead, the time to ensure that, you know, every one of us are on board with the right things is now. Peter Albee is a man who has his own money. Don't forget that he's a businessman. But well, that's not the aim. He's not coming to show to Nigerians that I have a deep pocket. For crying out loud, he doesn't have the kind of money Tinubu or I know he's a businessman. Tinubu or Atiku has. But what he has is a heart. What he has is a, is a mind. What he has is, is a country. You hear him speak passionately, telling Nigerians that it's about time. Whether you like it or not, there is real serious call for concern. There is reasons why every one of us, okay, must do that which is absolutely right and necessary. We understand and we totally get it and completely that, um, you know, Buhari wants to support his, his own party man. Fair enough, you should support your people, but you don't have to support Peter B for him to win. You don't need to. If he's the one destined to win, he will win. All Nigerians need to do is recognize it and do that which is absolutely right and necessary. You know, before you know it, you know, the country will become that nation that every one of us, you know, gradually things will begin to change. It's not like Peter Obi comes in, shake the magic wand and everything fall in place. You know, that's not what, that's not how it's going to happen or how it's going to be. But definitely I can tell you, okay, I can tell you this is, this is it. This is it. It's going to happen. Whether you like it or not, change is going to come. You see, leave us a comment. Remember that every one of us have a voice. Please speak out against oppression. Don't forget to like us, share, subscribe. God bless. Bye for now.